Okay, so uh, thanks for coming to my first unboxing video. Um, this is, I don't know how people do this. I've got kind of a weird setup here, um, but at least this time uh, now I have a decent mic, so hopefully you can hear me. And uh, so here is my very first Sabbath box. This is the first subscription box I've ever gotten. I have bought things from them before and really liked what I got. Um, like a while back, if I can get this thing, I got this Evil Eye charm from them uh, that was included in one of their earlier Sabbath boxes, and I really like this. It's These are all um, glass, glass beads, and I just always have it hanging in my room. <clears throat> so, okay, let's cut in and see what's happening here. It seems like kind of a it's not a huge box, so it's kind of light, so I don't know what they've packed in it. Let's see if I can get in here. Maybe I should have cut the tape ahead of time. I'll cut myself. Oh, come on. So, as you can see, these come in... Um, plain unmarked boxes. The return address just says SB shipping department. So it's all very anonymous and you don't have to worry about your evangelical neighbors having a fit or if the postman is... oops, got more tape on the sides. And so this is the Ostara box from Sabbath Box. So let's see what kind of goodies we have. So, blooming, blooming Prosperity. Ostara Sabbath Box. Oh, okay. So I guess this is everything that's supposed to be in here. Oh, looks like I got another statue, which <laughs> I already have one, but that's okay. So let's take a look. This is very pretty. This little sticker. Oh, stay. Oh, pretty. <laughs> very nice packaging. Is this supposed to be? I'm guessing it's a little candle or something. Yeah, probably the beeswax candle. Feels very light. Beeswax is very light. I'm one of those people who hates to tear wrapping paper. Focus. Nylokens Owen. Success and Prosperity. Handcrafted. Ooh. It smells nice. Very pretty. Let's see. Moving on. This is nice. Oh, I bet this is the goddess statue. Nice bag. Nice, nice satin. Yep. <laughs> now I've got a pair. That's okay. Actually, I think my original one has a little crack in it, so it'd be nice to have a spare just in case the other one ever completely breaks. Not sure how I did that. Oh my goodness. Oh, 
Okay, tape is like impossible to see on this stuff. Oh my goodness. Okay, we're going to need the happy scissors again. Where did I put them? Okay, enough. Yep. Oh, pretty. It's got like little gold dusting on it. I don't know if you can see that in the light. Let's turn this down maybe a bit. There's some like gold powder or something dusted over it. But yeah, it's Pretty much the same as the one I got. But that's okay. Don't want to set her here for now. See what else we got? got some ritual oil. Earthen Alchemy Prosperity Anointing Oil. And for those who haven't seen my tattoo, there it is. Yay! And what do we have here? Oops. What do we have here? What is this? So I found the candle, the oil. The statue. Oh, it's a pyrite chunk. Pyrite, aka fool's gold, is an iron min mineral often used along with magic or workings pertaining to prosperity and finances, so it only seemed natural to include a beautiful specimen within each of your prosperity centered Sabbath boxes. While it is not as valuable as real gold, it is often found in formations where gold is nearby, hence its association. See info card for more lore. Let's take a look at that. It's tied up in its own little bag. Oh, oh more bubble wrap. Whoops. Something just fell there. Packaged with a little um, four leaf clover charm. And we can see it. Come on, focus. There we go. It says joy. Yeah, camera's having a little trouble focusing on that. Alrighty. Okay, we're not doing this again. Pretty sure my scissors aren't going to hurt this at all. Hmm, very sparkly. <laughs> Pretty. Alrighty. I got an info card, but and prosperity kit. What do we have here. Let's see. Prosperity kit. Custom made herbal sachet kit. Oh, okay. By Light of Anjou. Mojo bags, also known as charm bags or sachets, as they are often referred in. Various paths are an old form of magic that practitioners have used for centuries. The kit we have included in your Sabbath box can be used as a complete spell by itself, or it can be used as a component of your own ritual working. So let's see, it's got alfalfa, spearmint, and chamomile, a lucky I Ching coin, a piece of green aventurine, and simple instructions. 
Let's take a look. More stuff to cut through. Alfalfa, spearmint, and chamomile, green aventurine stone, and Ching coin. For luck and prosperity, combine the coin and stone with the herbs in the bag. Feel free to add additional money drawing herbs or items of your choosing. Say a small blessing over the bag. Luck and prosperity come my way and wear on your body or hang in your home. Activate by squeezing the bag. Recharge under the full moon. Green stuff. Ching coin, adventuring, and bag of herbs. Hmm. Okay, we probably don't need to open that. And I think what we got under here. Ooh, some nice incense. I was just thinking I needed some new incense. Blooming Prosperity, Ostara Dual Blend. Mm. Oh, it smells wonderful. Oh, it's the Honeysuckle. It contains Honeysuckle and Early Spring Blooming Flowers Essential Oils. That's what I'm smelling, is the Honeysuckle. Oh, it's wonderful. Can't wait to light one of those tonight. Hmm. Made in Canada. Have to look into them. Now let's see. The packing paper. A couple of info cards. Oh, well, that's nice. This is the info card for the pyrite. Tells its planetary associations, chakra, goddess, zodiac, element is air or fire. Zodiac, Leo, and Aries. Well, I'm a Leo, so that's good. This is a nice, nice, like an information card. So, be something you add to your book of shadows. So, yeah, that's kind of fun. So, I forget what exactly these cost to do every. Uh, they come, you know, every Sabbath, so eight times a year. I think it's $49, $49.95, something like that. So, yeah, not bad. Something else. Pyrite and oil. Lots of goodies. So, that was fun to come home to. Anyway. So thanks for watching and joining me for my first unboxing video here and I uh, hope uh, to do more of these and see you back here again.